Hi, in this video, I will be showing you problem number 6 of chapter 9, section 4. Suppose a population P of T satisfies dP by dt equal to 0.8P minus 0.001P square with the initial condition P of 0 equal to 40 where T is measured in T years. A. What is the carrying capacity? B. What is P prime 0? C. When will the population reach 50% of the carrying capacity? The logistic model for the population is dP by dt equal to k times p times 1 minus p over m, where m is the carrying capacity. So we want to write the given equation in the problem. Say this equation 1. Um, in this form, k times p times 1 minus p over m. So let's consider the given equation dp by dt, which is equal to 0.8p minus 0.001p square. So we want to write this. So we want to write this equation in this form kp times 1 minus p over m. So we can take uh, the 0 0.08 p outside and 1 minus uh, 0 0.001 over 0 0.8 uh, p. So this would be 0 0.8 p times 1 minus uh, 0 0.001 over 0 0.8 would be 0 0.00125. 0 0.00125. So this can be written as 0 0.8 p times 1 minus p over 800. So we are bringing, we are writing the equation dp by dt in the form k p times 1 minus p over m. So we stated that if this is in this uh, dp by dt is k p times 1 minus p over m form, then the denominator of p will denote the carrying capacity. Here the denominator of p is p over, um, is 800. So 800 is the carrying capacity. So what is k? k would be equal to 0 0.8. So k equal to 0 0.8 and m which is the carrying capacity equal to 800. That answers part A. The second part of the problem B is asking us to find what is P prime 0. That is the derivative at t equal to 0. The derivative of P at t equal to 0. Here we have to make use of the fact uh, the condition given in the problem p of 0 equal to 40. This is given in the problem. So this tells when t equal to 0, p equal to 40. So p prime t is given in the problem which is dp by dt. That's what uh, is given in the problem which is 0.8p minus 0 0.001p square. So we are evaluating this at t equal to 0. So it is dp by dt evaluated at t equal to 0. When t equal to 0, p equal to 40. When t equal to 0, p equal to 40. So plug in p equal to 40. So this will give us 32 minus 1.6 which is 30.4 so p prime 0 p prime 0 is given by 30.4 solution to the logistic model dp by dt equal to kp times 1 minus p over m is p equal to m over 1 plus a times e to the negative k t where a equal to m 
minus p sub 0 divided by p at 0. p sub 0 is uh, the population at time t equal to 0, our initial population. m is the carrying capacity. So, uh, we have to determine the solution um, and then we have to make use of the fact um, that the population is 50% of the carrying capacity. So, for that we have to determine what time um, the population becomes 50% of the carrying capacity. So, let's start finding the value of A first. So, A equal to M, uh, the value of M that we found out is the carrying capacity. This is given here which is 800. So it's 800 minus p sub 0 which is population, initial population which is 40 divided by 40. So this will be equal to 19. So 800 minus 40 that will be 760 divided by 40 that will be equal to 19. Um, then we have to find out what this p is. Uh, uh, that is 800 carrying capacity m 800 1 plus we found out a so we can plug in that one then e to the negative uh, k k is also known here k is what we found out uh, earlier that is nothing but 0.8 so we can substitute the value of k here so that will be 0.8 or 0.8 t it says in the problem uh, P, the population is 50% of the carrying capacity. P is 50% of the carrying capacity. So now the population is 50% of 800 or half of 800 which is 400. So, substituting that over here, it's 400 equal to 800 divided by 1 plus 19 e to the uh, negative point, negative 0 0.8 t. In this, we have to solve for t. So, um, by cross multiplying, you get 1 plus 19 e to the negative 0 0.8 t equal to 800 over 400 that will be equal to 2. So, 19 e to the negative 0 0.8 t will be equal to if you move the 1 to the other side it will be 2 minus 1 which will be a 1. In other words e to the negative 0 0.8 t will be equal to 1 over 19. So, it is negative 0 0.8 t equal to ln of 1 over 19 or we can divide both sides by um, negative 0 0.8 or t will be equal to ln of 1 over 19 and divided by negative 0 0.8 if you calculate that in your uh, calculator that will be approximately 3.68. We are asked to uh, round the answer to two decimal places. As in the problem it says t denotes the number of years. So we can say after 3.68 years the population uh, becomes 50% of the carrying capacity. So t in years is approximately 3.68 years. Hope this video.